Here's a 1969 Roadrunner from Plymouth that has made its way front and center here at Meekin Dallas. Hey, Chris, a bit of a head scratcher here. You previewed this one for us and took us through some of the, shall we say, the confusion of the build. I'm going to go ahead and have you repeat that uh, for some of the folks that haven't seen it. First of all, nice, potent 440 under the hood there, putting out about 550 horsepower. Tremec five-speed manual transmission. But how about those exterior cosmetics? Well, and I want to correct something I said in my preview. So it is a 69 Roadrunner, but you may notice it's missing that brake in the fenders and the quarters that are typically on a 69 Roadrunner. That's because the quarters are from a 70 Roadrunner. Hence the scoop in the quarter okay. panel. Now the fenders are a 69, but it's missing that ridge, and it was hand hammered out by the guy that built this car. That's some serious metal work. Beautiful job here. The kin dig it, door handles on there, and also, John, a fuel injection system made to look like a six pack setup. Really trick. Very trick indeed. Custom built by folks at Iron Horse Classics. Wiley, Texas. Reserve is off at a buck sixty-five. They got one seventy asking one seventy-five. One eighty-five. It'll be two hundred and put an end to it. It'll be two hundred. So a big jump there, 200. Let's see if that's going to be enough or if he's still going to climb. Wasn't enough. Yeah. One more. One more. Give him a little courage, man. Give him a little courage. He got you beat. They got you 20. The reserve came off in the 150, 160 miles an hour range. It was 165. 250. These guys are throwing some hard right crosses, heavyweight bout going on here. This might be the number here, $250,000. Currently the high bid. There it is. That was Hearns versus Hagler coming down the stretch there. That was nice. No kidding.